How's it going? Uh, so this week has been okay. I mean, after my grandma passed away last week, I've just been like taking it slow, really, like just sorting out my emotions and just trying to cope with it, really. Like, I took my passing of grandpa really difficult about five years ago, so. Like, I was just really majorly depressed for many, many weeks after that, and I guess I just kind of, through that experience, I kind of learned to cope with these things a little bit better, so after Grandma passed, I mean, obviously I'm sad, but I think with experience, I've kind of learned to cope with it a bit better, so I mean, like I said, I am sad and depressed about it, but just, I feel like I'm managing my emotions and depression a little bit more better this time. So, yeah, just mainly just been taking it slow this week and just, again, just managing my emotions for now. But, um, as for the week itself, like, I went to Woodside again and I continued my 3D sculpture of my character just giving it another coat of paint really and started painting the hair and the weapons and stuff so not too much progress but I think it's going somewhat steadily and then after that we did some life drawings this time and one of my classmates was asked to be the life model the first drawing was really quick like the most important was to get her basic shape first before adding the details so we only had about 10 minutes for it so overall it was quite a rush to do that drawing but the second drawing was much longer so we had much more time to get the basic shape done and then add in all the details and overall i think it went okay i mean i did a bit of live drawing back in college so but that was many years ago so I was somewhat familiar how to go about these kind of drawings, but um, I think overall it was okay. And then for the rest of the week, again, it's still been very cold and rainy this week, so I mean, I've just been staying indoors most of the time, and like I said, just taking it slow for now, but to keep myself sort of occupied and something to focus on, I've already started planning on my new book and for the moment the working title is an assassin a bear and a seventh grader but i'm not sure if that will stick or not like it's just a working title for now but um after my previous book which is aimed more for kids and stuff i decided to go for a much more darker and mature story this time just to kind of like switch things up a bit really and see what I can do in this kind of tone so yeah this book is going to have three major characters I've already sketched out some characters for the book and this is going to be the main character and but also he's kind of the villain of the story and he's like a very secretive assassin so and then next we have the bear character which is also another major character and this is like the gay bear of the story so he's going to have quite a major role and then this is the third major character and she's like the disabled and paralyzed character but she also has quite a major part in the story and then this is going to be the assassin when He's not in that role, so he's just a regular man, really, in this picture. And this time around, I decided to go for a bit of a more sort of comic sort of style. So it's got much more harsher shadowing and stuff. Like, nothing is finalized yet, but it's just like the basic sort of look it's going to be, I think. And as I mentioned last week, my mum is going to be going to Hong Kong next week, so... She'll be going for two weeks and I mean I am a bit nervous again like being home alone and stuff and having to take care of myself but I mean it's not the first time and I think I'll be able to manage 
And like I said before, what's important is that my mum is by grandma's side at this time. So basically grandma's daughters and sons are all going back to Hong Kong to sort of say their farewell really. So yeah, I'm just going to have to manage and cope with myself being home alone again. But um, I think it'll be fine. And that's my mood this week. Like I said, I'm still kind of taking it slow after the passing of my grandma, like sorting out my emotions. And so overall, it's been really up and down, really. Like sometimes I just feel really sad and depressed, but other days I just kind of feel okay. So, yeah, like I said, I just got to take this week slow for now and just manage with my emotions, really. But um, I think that's pretty much it for this week. So overall, taking it slow, start to work on my new book. Um, my mum's going to Hong Kong for two weeks. And yeah, like my emotions have just been up and down and still taking it slow, really. So I think that's it for this week. So hopefully I'll see you next Saturday. That's it for this video. Thank you so much for watching and remember, always look forward, keep hope alive and remember, you're somebody.